For more than four decades, a piece of music history has been sitting, not so quietly, in Portland's backyard. Still, many have never heard her. New at 5.30, Quint Local 6 anchor Chad Carter recently listened in as she piped out some of her greatest hits. Tucked away inside Lewis and Clark's Agnes Flanagan Chapel, sitting as high as the notes it sings, the beauty of Bach pours out of a historic organ most have never heard. When you really have everything in place, you're doing something really well, it kind of feels like you're flying. Former student and organist Christopher Keedy plays part conductor and part soloist at the keys of the world's only circular pipe organ. 5,000 pitch perfect pipes orchestrated in a concert of sound suspended five stories above the audience. And I was just astonished at how beautifully this organ fit this room, not just visually, but tonally. It is a perfectly scaled instrument, as we say. Though getting it that way was as delicate as the pipes themselves. Needing to fit inside an already round chapel, the college approached multiple builders, but many shied away. Until renowned organ maker Lawrence Phelps stepped in. Inaugurated in 1972, now 40 years later, it still showers the chapel with a powerful chorus of sound. A massive showpiece that can hush the crowd. It is an astonishingly gentle organ for as loud and bright as it can be. Uh, I also know it to be very, very gentle and beautiful. Today, the organ is as much attraction as it is educational. And all those who hear or play it know the magic of the music, leaving a legacy as strong as the instrument itself. After you finish playing, before people start clapping, there's this kind of little hush that can be really long because people are just kind of absorbing it or listening to the sound die away in the room. That's kind of like a sacred moment almost. Reporting for you, Chad Carter, Coin Local 6.